Oh no, I got stuck. He literally used his power on me five times. You lost three gens. What are you doing? Hey all, it's Tat. I've been asked this particular question a lot, so instead of replying to each of you with the same response, I figured it would just be easier to make a video instead. So, why do I use Frank's mixtape? Why would I use one of the absolute worst add-ons in the game, which actively works against you? Because down in a survivor with Feral Frenzy is incredibly satisfying, and very few players expect to go down to a legion during Feral Frenzy. I've gone against many streamers who had no idea what I was doing, or that the add-on even existed. Of course, there's a lot of ignorance around it. Since the killer can't see the deep wound timer, a lot of players believe it simply has no effect, even though it does. So I partially use Frank's mixtape because I enjoy it, and because it's a different way to play as the Legion, which from my experience, most players seem to enjoy, as I'm not immediately leaving them to go chase someone else. While I'm at it, I may as well answer another question I've been asked, which is about the initial release of the Legion. While it was a lot of fun to play as the Legion, it was irritating to go against, as there was no counterplay. I would not want to go back to the way things used to be, and when it comes to Frank's mixtape, while I want the add-on buffed by another 2.5 seconds, I wouldn't want it to be oppressive. I'd like it buffed to the point where you can consistently use the add-on without losing the match to do so, but not too powerful as where it could be used all the time. So those are the reasons I use Frank's mixtape, and those are my thoughts on the initial release of Allegiant. I hope this cleared up any immediate questions you have all had, and if you have any more, feel free to swing by my Twitch channel. I stream almost every single day, and yes, Frank's mixtape is mostly what I do. Thanks for watching.